Kovalchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich here. This evening, we bring you two teams matched up as they've been so many times before. Tonight, it's a game between Team Canada and the Czech Republic. Before the faceoff, Eddie, what do you think? Two teams that have two well-crafted game plans, but once the puck drops, anything can happen, Doc, as we've seen in the past. I believe the key to this game is who stays to their game plan. Looking for options. Dishes it back. Saved on the miss. Ribbons got the whistle and a rest. Lee's been in discomfort since this hit here. Lee's a little wobbly as he's headed straight back to the dressing room with the trainer. They're going to be very careful. This looks like a head injury. A little under four minutes gone. Up the wing, still with possession and with hope. Outstanding save made off a terrific chance. Puck covered, whistle blown. Scrivens reads the play very well. It doesn't take much to see that it's an odd man rush, but he finds the puck and makes a stop. The Czech Republic's on the move in the defensive zone. Let's it go. Score! A terrific goal for the Jacks. The shooter had a couple of different options here. He could pass or shoot. He decided on the latter and beat the goaltender clean. I don't know what he's going to do with that one, Edzo. That thing is delivered to perfection. That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start. They were ready to play, and it shows on the shot clock as well. The Czechs prevail on the draw. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Wonderful wrist shot. They score! And they've tied the game up. Goalie was surprised at how quick that snapshot got on him. His technique is good. The butterfly is really solid. He just gets beaten with a better shot here. We go down to the benches. Here's Ray. Word from the home team's locker room is they're going to be short a player for the rest of the night. The injury occurred a while ago. He will not return. Breakaway chance. He scores! He had people chasing him down on a breakaway, but he found a way to score. Edzo, this has got to be a great shot because from my angle, there doesn't look like a lot of net. Even with the goaltender down, he seems to have most of it covered. Canada's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Good stick presence by Roy. Canada's in their own end and carrying it on. Onside. Goalie to the bench on the delayed call. Extra man is out. Gives it on a cross from the point. Referee over to the penalty box, and let's find out. Team Czech Republic sent to the box for two minutes. It's tripping. Now, oh, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. Gets across, looks over his options. He caught it and he holds on. Oh, did he ever get matched? He might have seen him at the last minute to absorb that hit. First period is finished. Both teams scored, but there is a lead to carry into the locker room. The Canadians own a one-goal lead. Hey, fans, we'd like to draw your attention to the far part of the arena where we're welcoming all of our minor... Team Canada's, teams Canada's one goal tonight. lead came on this play. We want to show it to you one more time as we go to break. Strong play on that faceoff. You have to be strong to hold that other guy off. Score! 
three straight goals. We're so far up here, Doc. I'm not sure if that puck got deflected. Let's go down to Ray and see what he saw at ice level. Not only was the puck deflected, Enzo, it's through traffic as well. You're going to see on the replay that the goaltender's fighting A, the traffic. He's got to get into position for it. Right when he thinks he's got the puck at him, the puck changes directions. He just can't catch up. Good job on that faceoff, tying the man up. Moving it to Bruin. And now it's directed to Roy. Shot! Oh, a close call there. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to cut his stick on a changing shot. That diffuses the attack for now. Shot. How did he get it? Muscled off. Holds in the corner. Oh, deflected away. Scrivens keeps his team in it. That's another odd man rush against, but he's equal to the task. Let's a shot go. At the point with it. Blocked. Pass attempt to Raymond. Team Canada is carrying on along the boards. He's in. Great save. Shutting down one of the best. The drama heightens in this one. Solid glove save. Puck covered, whistle blown. Franz has to follow the puck here. His team gets caught a man coming down the ice, but he makes the save. Trying to go to LaPierre. Gains the zone. Fires. He scores! Just before the period ends. The goaltender had no chance stopping that puck with the quick release. Sometimes your best isn't enough. This is a perfect shot up over a desperation attempted glove save. The Canadians have built a tremendous lead and also built some wonderful confidence. What will they say in the second intermission? Probably not much. Pitching this one to Horak. Let's it go. Forty minutes have been played in this contest and everyone gets a break, but just for a moment, third period coming up. Listen up, fans. For tonight only, all team jerseys are 15% off regular price with the presentation of your ticket stub. Get yours before they're all gone. The Czech Republic suffering in net. Probably their whole team play needs to be re-examined during this intermission, but the goaltenders had a rough night. Here's an example as we go to break. They win it. Canada's up in arms here. They feel their goaltender was interfered with. The referee's going to agree. This will be no goal. Takes a shot. Held there for a faceoff coming up next. Team Canada is in possession along the boards. That hits somebody. Wrist one. Score for Team Canada. That 
shot shows you it's never a bad play to get the puck to the net. And so the goalie thinks he's got this puck stopped. Look at how he reacts. He stops so much of it. He thinks it's in his equipment somewhere, but it trickles into the net. And that's a face-off win. Takes a perfect pass. Well, that's what your wings are for. They give it to you right in the center. Play is stopped, and now we'll hear the call. Canada's given a minor here for tripping. I'm going to give credit to the puck carry here. He kept his legs moving. He forced the back checker to reach in and take him off his... A shot! Oh, a save. And that's it. The game is over. Looked like the game was over at the end of two periods. It was not over, and it had a thrilling finish. Pretty simple mindset. Get people and pucks to the net, and they were rewarded. Just not enough. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.